Orison Hammond with the latest on this story. Julian. Julie, investigators formally ruling out foul play in this tragic incident. The heartbroken family getting the news that they have been fearing now for 11 days. Hammond, Indiana police with assistance from dozens of law enforcement agencies in the region finding the boy's body last night after cutting off water flow to the Little Calumet River. The water level dropped close to five feet. In fact, if you look at pictures that were taken yesterday, you could literally see the high water mark and where the actual water level was. It was five feet down, which helped us. The highly unusual measure credited with improving search conditions and the recovery. The body of 12-year-old Kyren Carter, identified by the Lake County, Indiana coroner late last night. A gut-wrenching conclusion to this tragic incident. Carter and his loved ones in town from Kansas City. Carter, who was autistic and nonverbal, was visiting family here celebrating an engagement when he disappeared 11 days ago and the search began. Police used a drone to confirm the discovery of the body identified last night by the Lake County, Indiana coroner. Hammond police and other rescuers working literally around the clock for 11 days. Investigators even using a remote controlled unmanned submarine to search the bottom before the decision was made to dam the Little Calumet River, making it easier for search teams to spot the body. Investigators who'd been in close contact with Carter's family through all of this Revealing what we have suspected for days now that there is no evidence here of foul play. We have ruled out uh, foul play on this. Obviously, it's an unfortunate uh, situation. Uh, we've dedicated a lot of man hours in obtaining uh, video surveillance uh, that was captured from various businesses in the area. It is now up to the Lake County, Indiana coroner to determine the boy's official cause of death. Law enforcement and the Hammond community doing everything in their power to try and safely find Kyrene Carter. The kayaker who discovered the boy's body was filled with emotion. This tragic incident, heartbreaking for everybody involved. At Hammond Police Headquarters, Julian Cruz.